Hi, I'm Kevin Kilbuck, Director of Strategic Marketing for Micron Technology. I'd like to spend a few minutes today to talk to you about an exciting new product that Micron, together with our manufacturing partner Intel, are introducing. Now, this product is a 25 nanometer, 64 gigabit, triple level cell NAND. Um, and before I talk more about the product, let me uh, just talk some about, about the basics of the technology. I threw out a lot of buzzwords there. Uh, first of all, 25 nanometer is the process technology that we use to, to fabricate this. And in the semiconductor world, we're always striving to um, come up with the, this, the smallest uh, process geometry we can to reduce our cost and to provide more uh, capacity, more density to the end user. In fact, uh, uh, Micron and Intel are leading the industry with our 25 nanometer product, which has been in production uh, for several months now for, for MLC NAND. And then uh, this diagram uh, will show the difference between a single level cell, multi-level cell, and triple level cell um, flash. And uh, in, in, the, in the flash world or in the, in the digital world of, of computers and consumer electronics, the basic storage element or the bit is a one or a zero. So with F SLC, we can store one bit, MLC two bits, and with TLC, we can store three bits. So combining 25 nanometer and TLC technology yields the uh, world's most advanced uh, and densest and the lowest cost uh, flash memory technology. And this is a silicon wafer that we produce in our fabs and I don't know if you can see it very well on the video, but on this wafer there are hundreds of these uh, individual rectangles, which are about the size of my fingernail. One of those rectangles is the 64 gigabit TLC die that we're producing. And um, if you do the math, uh, we can achieve uh, almost four terabytes of storage on this single wafer, which is a huge uh, increase from where we were just, just a few years ago. And um, and the other thing to keep in mind about uh, the technology, the different uh, number of bits per cell, um, as we, of course, as we increase the number of bits per cell, we're able to reduce our cost and increase the capacity simply because we have more bits in, in the same area. Um, there are some trade-offs, however. Uh, the performance and the endurance, uh, as measured in the number of times you can program the NAND, uh, tend to degrade as we increase more bits per cell. Uh, but keep in mind that there are uh, many applications today, such as USB flash drives, flash cards, uh, MP3 players, that are already using a TLC technology. And Micron's working very hard with other uh, players in the industry to enable a TLC in, in other applications. Um, so what's that all mean for you uh, as a consumer of NAND? Um, well, first of all, I showed you know, these, these individual die that are, that are fairly small. We, we uh, package them in a package such as this, and today we're able to get eight die in a single package. Um, so we talk bits, consumers tend to think of bytes. Um, so you're actually able with this technology to get uh, 64 gigabytes of capacity in a single package. So to you, the consumer, it means more capacity uh, in a very small footprint at a very low cost point. And just to put that into perspective, Think back a few years, you probably had a, a 40 or a 60 or maybe an 80 gigabyte hard drive in your computer, and now we're able to get uh, that capacity in a much, much smaller form factor. And it, it's enabled by uh, this technology that we're announcing today, uh, which is sampling. It's available today, and it will be in production by the end of the year. Uh, I think that's about it for today. If you have any questions, please post them on microneblogs.com, and thank you for your time.